It's the Brew Review. Let's go. It's the Brew Review. Everybody get your hands up for the Brew Review. Come on, everybody, let's dip it on back. Body, head, and cap, show me what you got on that tap. Cause it's K-Dog and Mr. GMC. Everybody here knows that it's BYOB. Tell me how it tastes. Tell me, tell me how it smells. Is it that old bud or that yang ling hell? But it's time to get it started, so we started off right. It's the Brew Review, so we gonna party all night. Let's go. It's the Brew Review. All right, what's going on, guys and gals? And we are back for another fine edition of the Brew Review. And what we got for you today is something local from Pennsylvania. A local beer. Yeah, so we have this beer called Keystoner. Not to be confused with Keystone. No. Not the skank rock gut stuff. This is a local thing here. So we rotate the can. You can see <laughs> signs for 81 and 83. You got a VW bus. I'm assuming that's what it is. And it's like, I don't give a... F or you give a fuck license plate. Six percent volume. I seventy six, which is a turnpike. Proudly brewed in Pennsylvania. Yeah, keep refrigerated. Please enjoy fresh, preferably with pizza. Do not age. So this is one that you do not sit in your fridge for six months. So yeah, so Pizza Boy Brewery. Yeah, pizza beer happy. And then you got your government warning. And here you are. Oh, you're done. I'm sorry. Uh, he was like dazed out. Sorry. Pizza Boy Brewing Company, uh, also part of Owls of Hampton, which is a very famous place, a local place. Uh, keep refrigerated. Brewed and can by Valley Road Enterprises, 2240 Millennium Way, Enola, Pennsylvania. As you said. Uh, proudly brewed in PA. So, it's a home beer. That's no doubt about that. And it'd be their debut on this show. Uh, India Pale Ale with oats and wheat. Weast. That, uh, weast. Yeah, that should be interesting. Uh, I don't think I've ever had it. IPA with oats and yeast. Well, I'm, obviously they have yeast, but oats. But love the can. Very, very much hippie vibes on this one. I'm getting hippie vibes with the van. Is it just me? You all right? I'm fine. Are you all right? I'm all right. All right, then. I'm ready to drink more. So, as tradition, as usual, we're going to do the opening of the can test, the drink test, the draft test. The after burp test, all that good stuff. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and pop it. And it smells like grass. Yes, I'm getting hops. Not very, not a strong hop, but it's there. It's IPA, so... It's yeah, so it's expected. So, I'm not going to fault it for that. Yeah, it warned a, us. That is an IPA. <laughs> But like I said, I mean the packaging. Look at it. Oh just, no! Just it, look at it. Would you just look at just it? Look at it. Anyhow, Keystoneer. Not can we not to be confused with Keystone. Not, Let's try no, it. Not the Keystone State. It's brewed of the Keystone State, but not the Keystone. Flavor burst. Flavor. The grass is strong when you initially taste it. Right. I still have an aftertaste of it, but it's slowly fading. No, uh, so it's not one of those that sticks around like a fart. I still taste it. You still taste it, so it does. A little stick, bit. So it does. Stick yeah, around the, like a the, fart. yeah. The after the aftertaste does stick. Oh lord. Then this isn't going to be a good one for me. So, yeah, you might want to have pizza with it when you drink it, like they recommend. See, I wouldn't eat pizza with this beer. Like, when I eat pizza... But they say so. I know they say so, but why would you have an IPA with pizza? It makes no damn sense. 
Okay, I, I still taste the grass, but it's slowly fading. I so taste Yeah, you definitely get the uh, the full effect of it out the app. I did forget to mention on the can that the barcode does look like the the the, the state of PA. It does. It does. It does look like the Pennsylvania. I think he has a dry mouth over there. I have grass, grassy mouth. Mm. That's what you get when you drink an IPA like this. I mean, this is a pure IPA. Ooh. Looks very IPA-ish. That is cloudy with a chance of meatballs. <laughs> Quit humping the cup. I want to make sure I get every single hop and barley in there. Very yellowish. Let's get behind the camera here and look at it. As yellow as piss if you're dehydrated. Yeah, and it's got the head like piss when you pee in a cup. <sighs> Which is our like, public service. Alright, just, just a minute here. Ah. Public, service, okay. public service announcement. Make sure you're drinking enough water so that when you pee, it looks clear. Alright, I guess I'll do a draft on it. If See you, if it's any better. If you piss clear... It smells hoppy even in the cup. I'm giving a public service announcement. I don't see sediment. <laughs> if you piss clear, you are well hydrated. <sighs> you definitely got to glass it. Yeah. It's slightly better in the glass. I'll say Sli that. Slightly better. Slightly. Slightly better. That's like saying that the, the constipated shit that I took last week is going to be slightly better than the constipated shit I take this week. Not that I have to worry about that. The constipated shit? <laughs> yes, we have sound effects here at the whip. Good lord, I have a lot of head in here. <laughs> Not in the good way. <laughs> Yeah, I definitely glass it. It's less harsh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's gonna finish it off. You must pour that shit and then drink it. Pour it with a slice of pizza beside you. I don't buy that at all. I don't drink IPAs when I eat pizza. What do you drink when you eat pizza? I prefer lighter beers, to be honest. <clears throat> Remember, like, back in the day, bring, bring. you go to Pizza Hut in Shippensburg? You get yourself all pitcher of yingling with the personal pan pizza? That was a shit. I never did that, but... Or Pap did. Yeah, oh, yeah. Pap used to talk about, like, going to Pizza Hut and getting a whole pitcher of yingling. Honest to Pete! <laughs> yeah, that's what she would say. She didn't like it. You're kidding me! Honest to Pete. I'm sure he handed the keys over. Oh! Oh, Pap! <laughs> I messed up. Me too. That that cup holder over there, that was his. So, the Keystoner. I like it better in the glass. So, it, it did redeem itself a little bit yeah. there. I'm going to say. Packaging kicked ass. So, it they're did. definitely on the board. It did. Uh, and because it's local and, you know, 81, 83 and Turnpike. It definitely has a prolonged grass taste to it. So... If I'm going to give this anything, I will give it the IPA grade, which is a three, but the packaging will bump it up to at least a three and a half. So I will give it a three and a half. Packaging caught my eye. Packaging took it over the top, but it is an IPA as much as an IPA is an IPA. And that it's an IPA. Do you think it's an IPA? Yeah, how definitely. Many times, how many times can I say IPA? I can say it probably seven more times. I'm in PA. Oh, IP, okay. yeah, you, I am in PA. I got, yes, yes. And I am in PA. I am too. <laughs> I, PA. Okay. You're great, sir. Okay, so my rating, packaging, fucking awesome. Puts them on the board, for sure. Caught my eye. It worked. I wasn't too sure about it, drinking it out of the can, but then we did it in the glass. It got less harsh that way. It redeemed itself a little bit. 
I'm going to give it a good solid four. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so, uh, I mean, the first drink, I was like, uh, I don't know about mm. it. Second drink, it's like, yeah, it's, 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 it's better. I'll, I'll give it a chance. That's my rating. Four. All right, hey. To each their own. I'm not a particular fan. I, I won't, like, get a six-pack of it or nothing like that. But right, right. Hell, give it to me at a party and I'll drink it. It's at least worthy to try. I mean, it's this is the first beer that I've had from Pizza Boy Brewing Company. So. Now, they did warn us, however, that you must drink it fresh. Yeah. So, with that in mind, if I craft another six-pack where I got this from and get the other ones that were made by them, we're going to have to do them all, like, right in a row. Drink it fresh! So at least they warn you. I'll give them that, too. Because I... MMPA. I MMPA. I PA. Jason Callen. Jason Callen. He's in PA. He's IPA. Even though he's like five hours from us. <laughs> he's still IPA. My coworkers, <laughs> they're not in PA. They're, they're no, you're not in PA, you, you damn traitors. What Maryland? Maryland? Fuck Maryland! No, no, they, Maryland gives me my income. No, fuck Maryland. That's what I said. My in-laws live in Maryland. Fuck Maryland. I'm just totally kidding. I, Maryland I really pays like, my bills, damn it. I really like Maryland. It's, it's not a bad state, but fuck them. So why is it like the way it's spelled? Is Maryland? It, should, yeah, shouldn't it be called Maryland? I don't know. Why are we talking about this? I don't know, we're rambling. Anyway, we hope you enjoy... Let's pick the next beer. Yeah, we hope you enjoy this evening's of Pizza Boys, Keystone Beers, IPAs. Because I am a PA! We'll see you next week, people. Thank God.